Hello there, welcome back. Welcome to this video on yoga for neck release. My name is Anya, I'm very pleased to be here with you today. We're going to work on a sequence that is very nourishing and releasing for the area of the neck or the muscles around the neck that help, help us hold up the head, which is quite a heavy thing sometimes, especially if there is a lot of thoughts going on up there. And we also likely work into the area of the upper back, the area of the yeah, the muscles around here, the trapezius, and hopefully it will feel that your shoulders drop by the end of the practice. Make sure you get comfortable. You don't need a mat. You can sit anywhere where you can feel you can get into an upright seated posture. And I look forward to seeing you in a moment. Thank you for tuning in. Today's practice seated. So anywhere where you find a nice comfortable ground make sure you sit upright. Take the fleshy part away from underneath your hips, your sit bones and allow your palms to rest anywhere on your legs, your thighs and allow the shoulders already here to soften and drop away from the ears. Before we start our physical practice we take a moment closing the eyes or softening the gaze to tune into our breath. And as we don't have too much time today, but we still wanna focus on that very important part, the most important part of our practice, the breath. We take three rounds of cleansing breaths. So whenever you're ready now, take an inhale through the nose, deep breath in. Draw the breath down into your belly, hold it for a moment, and then lightly open your mouth and exhale to release. Two more of those. Inhale through the nose. Lightly open your mouth. Hold the breath for a moment and exhale. All the way out. For the last round, inhale. Again, through the nose. Deep breath in. Lightly open the mouth and exhale, exhale, exhale. All the way through the mouth. Beautiful work. Now you can keep your eyes closed or you can open your eyes slightly with a soft gaze. Now from here, place your hands onto your legs with the palms facing down. With the inhale, lift your shoulders all the way up to your ears. So that position of feeling uncomfortable or quite often we actually feel our shoulders are up there when we hold stress, when we carry tension. Lightly push the legs away wherever you are in your seated posture. Inhale, squeeze. And then again, lightly open your mouth and exhale. Drop them all the way down. Two more of those. So quicker exhale, inhale. All the way up, lift them, lift them, lift them. Squeeze them up to your ears. Lightly push the knees away. And then open your mouth and let go. All the way out. Very nice. That should feel great. The last round, inhale, deep breath in. All the way, all the way up. Squeeze them even higher. Push the legs away. Inhale, hold it. And then exhale to release. Very nice. From here, take your hands down to either side of your body and drop the left ear to your left shoulder. And as you drop the left ear, start to move your right hand more away from the body. Also, if you're sitting on a chair, you can have the hand in the air and you're just reaching that right palm away from you. With your palm on the mat, just spread your fingers wide and push through the tops of your fingers. Let's take a few breaths in and out here, working into the area of the right neck. And again, closing the eyes can be very, very soothing, very nice. But if you feel you're getting too relaxed, depending on where you practice, just keep your eyes lightly open. Let's take one more inhale, lightly reach that right hand away or push that right hand away. And then on the exhale, lift all the way back to center, right away onto the other side. Drop the right ear this time to the right shoulder and extend the left arm away from you. Spread your fingers wide. If the hand is on the mat, make contact with the floor and create a bit of resistance. So think of pushing the floor away and then reaching the head into the opposite direction. The right arm can be more soft this time. Imagine you have a band here that you wanna stretch out. So feel how from the left fingertips 
all the way into the top of your head. You create this nice long line. And then on the inhale, create a bit more length. On the exhale, soften a little bit, so relax for a moment. One more of these. Inhale, create length and distance between the shoulder and the ear. And then exhale to relax, bring the head all the way back to center. Very nice. Now, if you're in cross-legged, change the cross of your legs and just relax your arms. Have the hands softly down towards either side of your body. From here, turn your head past your right shoulder. And see if you can take that in steps rather than pushing the head into the direction. So you're slowly, slowly turning and you're just feeling how the neck reacts to that. Not thinking of where the body might want to go. Really listening to it and then feeling where it wants to go. Now, if you want more of a sensation looking past that right shoulder, you could again stretch the left arm away. Now, also, if you're on the floor, lift the hand and reach it into that opposite direction. A bit more of an intensity you could create with the right hand. Place it on your jawline and then just create a bit more of that rotation in the head to the neck. Again, it doesn't need much for, for the neck, so listen to that. Listen to how it feels. Take one more breath. Imagine breathing into those muscles that get that nice sensation and then come all the way back to center. And just allow your head to stay there for a moment. Give it a bit of time to come back to neutral and then let's turn the left ear to the left shoulder, head past the left shoulder. And then extend your right arm if you want more. So right away feeling what your body needs. <clears throat> you can also play with having the hand a bit further back or further forward. It will change the way you feel it through the neck. And then again, if you've done it on the other side, take your left hand, place it on your jawline and lightly draw your head further back. Now, as you have your eyes soft or closed, feel into your body and breathe through it. So take two more deep belly breaths here. Inhale, exhale, think of softening those muscles. Inhale, feeling the stretch, the length in that arm, the neck. Exhale to relax. Beautiful work and then come all the way back to center again very slowly and place your hands down onto the knees. Just take a moment to reclose your eyes and have a feel for which side of your neck feels more tight or more tender. We're going to do that one more on that side and if you feel it's about balance just choose any side. So for me I feel the left side needs a bit more opening that's why I drop the right ear to the right shoulder. This time hand comes onto the head and the other one comes onto the floor or again, away from the body again. And just acknowledging that our body is not always even. We might have one side that gets a bit more of that tightness. Could also be if you're writing with that hand that it's just, yeah, connected and therefore feeling a bit more, more, um, more tight. I don't like to say these words that sound negative, but again, we're here to release. So we are breathing into it and letting go of that. Very, very nice. Now come all the way back to center and then we take that into a rotational movement. So drop your left ear to the left shoulder and then bring your chin down to your chest. Right ear to the right shoulder and then for full circles, look up towards the skies. And then let's take four more of those. And as you're moving, see where you can find your breath. When does your inhale help you to move through it? And when does your exhale help you to release some of the tension? Let's change direction. Couple more rounds here. Very, very nice. Beautiful work. And then bring the head all the way back to center. For our last posture for today, drop your chin down to your chest. Bring your hands to your low back and start to squeeze your shoulder blades in towards one another. Think of the elbows kissing each other in the center. So they are moving, moving, moving. Your shoulder blades start to connect. Your upper back is still nice and long, but the head is tilting down. 
Now, if you feel this already gives you enough of a sensation, stay here or bring your hands to the back of your head, interlock your fingers and then bring your elbows forward and together. Curling the chin into the chest. Press your head slightly into your hands if you do so and with your hands create that resistance of moving down. We take three more cleansing breaths, the same way we started. We seal off our practice today. Inhale through the nose, wherever you are. Exhale. Inhale, breathe in new energy. Exhale, let go of some of that tension. One more, inhale. And exhale. To release, bring your head back to center, let go of the hold and then shake your palms out for a moment, shake your shoulders out, relax them. And also that's sometimes really good because you just think of washing it away. <laughs> I'm sure that looks very great <laughs> at the moment, but you can shake it out a bit more, take as long as you like. I look forward to seeing you again on this channel. Thank you for tuning in. Have a wonderful day from my heart to yours. Mm -hmm.